Hi, my name is Chien and welcome back to the Amproco Learning by Example project. And today in this video, I would like to show you how to create multiple language for Amproco website. Okay, so let's get started. This one is the website and currently we are using only one language on this website. And get us set into the back end. Admin Amproco. Go to the content. Home. Yeah. You can see here we have a home. So now I will open the setting. Setting. Document time. Home. I will click on the permission. You have to click on it. Allow content of this type in the root. Save it. Back to the content. You right click on home page and copy. Click on the content. Copy. Okay. Yes, and after that, the structure of home page will be copied into another instance. Okay, so I will call fully either English and the second one I will call it either Vietnamese. Uh, because Vietnamese is my mother language, so we call it in the second language here. Okay. I will change the name in English. Vietnamese is VN. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Okay. So you can see here, you the URL e has been changed to VN, and English not yet. Okay. Let's see. Okay. English. And the English still fine. And try to VN. Not work. Okay. Back to the VN. Yeah. You can see here after you copy all of the content of the English structure to a new instance of the Vietnamese. And all the basic here still not published. So you have to publish it. Right click on VN. Publish. Select. Select. Publish. Hello window. Yeah. It work. VN have been work. Okay, so actually when you hover into the generic element about it or another bit here, so if you click on this one. It will direct you back to the English. Actually, it should be the Vietnamese. Okay, so how to do it? You open the Visual Studio, open the web config. You have changed a little bit here. Hi. I'm going to go high top level, not from path. You change it to for. Be with okay. Back. Back to the admin pet. Refresh this one. English. Publish. English. Yes, it has been changed into the English in the URL. Generic. Yeah, same thing. Eleven. Okay. Cool. Yeah. 
Haiku. So now when you are in English, the you will see the URL here. It changed into English. English. Okay. And when you change it to Vietnamese, VN. See here. VN, VN. Okay, cool. I will come back to the Amarco admin to change a little bit of the content for the title. Okay. Back to the front end page. Yeah, you can see here when you are in Vietnamese, the text has been changed to the Vietnamese too. Back to the English. Yeah, it back to English too. Okay, so I think that's all for today. And after you finish this video, you know how to do the configuration for the to do the for implement multiple language into the Amarco website. I will come up with another video later for this one on about how to setting and do the coding for this. Bye bye and talk to you later.